Hey guys, EBP Man here, and today we're going to take a look at a series of products uh, from Patchworks that are all designed for the iPhone X. Let's go ahead and check it out. So if this uh, year you were able to pick up an iPhone X or an iPhone X, you may be looking for some accessories, or you may be wanting to add some more accessories to the ones you already have. And today we have several products from Patchworks. We have a front and back glass screen protector, and then we also have here some cases. So let's check and see how these cases work and if they support wireless charging. Now, as we look at each one of these products, I just wanted to encourage you guys to um, hit that subscribe button on the on the bottom right there so that you can help uh, the channel continue to grow. And as we get more products like these, you can get notified immediately when they become available. We're also going to be at CES this year, so uh, stay tuned for a video blog series where we're going to document our journey uh, to Vegas and our experience at CES, as well as we look to review several of the latest and greatest technologies that are going to be uh, available at the conference. Now, taking a look at this first case that we have here, this is the level. Uh, it's the level ITG, and it's daily damage defense. And this is a certified case uh, for drop protection, uh, which is good to see. We're seeing more and more cases like this that have that drop protection certification. And it's, this is critical because of the fact that, you know, when you look like a phone, both the Samsung phones and the iPhones have a glass back. You want to make sure that not only you protect the front, but you protect the back. And having that drop certification is a great thing. So let's go ahead and do the unboxing of this case. Now, a closer look at the case, you'll see that it does have that pattern inside that you see there that is designed really to help disperse any kind of impact uh, that your phone may experience if you drop it. Uh, the corners seem to be raised slightly, uh, so that's giving you like an extra bumper, and you can see how it kind of comes out here and here, as well as you see that on the bottom as well. Cutouts look pretty generous, and the material itself, while it has a... Um, I would say a sheen to it. It's not a shiny uh, case in any way, and it doesn't seem to be fingerprint, uh, a fingerprint magnet either. So let's go ahead and put our iPhone in the case, and we'll see how it looks, what kind of screen protection we have, and if the wireless charging works. All right, so the first thing we're going to look at is screen protection. So I'm going to put this in an angle right here so you can see what kind of edge you have. This has a tempered glass screen protector on it already, and you can see how it's coming up here in the sides. Very healthy screen protection right here, and it's also uh, very well done on the side as well. So I'd give this a definite thumbs up when it comes to screen protection, and it's uh, substantial enough that it doesn't uh, get minimized by a glass screen protector as I have here. You do have access to your mute button or vibration lock. Uh, here then you notice how your buttons are raised. Uh, you have a very um, a logo here. It doesn't really stand out so it's there. I think it's kind of cool looking. And then you have your camera protection. If we look at this it's uh, with the bump that comes out you still have some good protection. You notice that it's not flush in any way and also it's not going to provide that back flash that uh, can damage your photos. On the bottom you have your cutouts. Very generous. Notice how wide that is. That's like super wide. And then you have your speaker uh, grills available as well. Now from wireless charging we're going to put it in the wireless charging cradle. You'll notice that the light turned on and it is charging bring this into view, you'll see that the little lightning bolt is there. So it supports wireless charging as well. Now next up is the Aegis. Uh, this is a pretty interesting case too, and this features ultra rugged protection, meaning that it's going to have a higher degree of drop protection, uh, which is going to allow you to drop it from a higher level if that's the case. Uh, it has three levels of protection, it has triple layers. So let's go ahead and unbox it, see what it looks like, and try the wireless charging. So taking a look at this case, you can definitely feel that it, this is going to provide um, extended protection to your phone. Uh, nice, uh, durable back. Also, sides are very rigid. Bumper protection on the sides here. And then also this nice little pattern with this little cutout that's going to show your Apple logo. So let's go ahead and put our phone in and see what it looks like. All right, so now taking a look at the case uh, and the phone, you'll notice, first of all, how much material there is here based on this depth. So a lot of protection for the back of your phone, given that it's glass. You also have good back flash protection there. Nice grip on the sides. Buttons are very tactile. And you'll notice on here the same thing. Easy to flip that switch. From a screen protection, let's go ahead and cancel this. From a screen protection, you'll notice that the screen, uh, the sides come up just like the other one. So this is a thumbs up definitely when it comes to screen protection. And just the overall build, the feel just feels like it's like you're wearing a tank around your, your iPhone. So thumbs up on the case. Let's see how the wireless charging works and wireless charging is working. You see the light on and you see the little charging symbol there as well. So now the last case that we're looking at is the silhouette. This is a little different. 
this is actually a frame and we're seeing frames uh, make a strong comeback especially uh, with these thinner phones this is going to give you also still despite the fact that it's only a frame it is again military drop certified it's not going to be as durable as this triple layer one or um, I would say these fall kind of like into the same category, but it's still going to be able to protect your phone. I would combine this definitely with a glass back as well as the glass front, regardless of the case that you're going to use. Always a glass front, but in this case, I would definitely use the glass back. So let's go ahead and take a look at how this looks. All right, so now this is one really cool looking frame. Uh, let's look at the screen protection. One of the things that you'll notice is outstanding screen protection pretty consistent with all of these cases so you have a nice even though I have glass on here really nice raised edges all the way around now this is where this case um, changes now you'll notice here that you have this frame cutouts you have your buttons everything is nice there on the bottom you have that generous uh, cutout for your power cord your charging cable as well as your speakers and then also you have this other button right here uh, for your uh, Siri activation but now the back is completely exposed so you can see you it also has protection though because you notice how raised it is all going all the way around now even though you have some really nice protection that if you were to drop it like this you wouldn't have to worry about it I'm concerned about rocks when it comes to cases like this. That's why that tempered glass back comes into play, and that's why if you choose to go with a case like this, I'd also recommend the glass back. Wireless charging is going to work, so we're going to put it here. You'll notice that the light turns on, and the symbol's there. So even though it is raised, uh, it still charges without a problem. Now for their glass back, uh, Patchworks does include uh, the glass. It has a removal sticky for any kind of dust and then what you have is kind of like a little instruction guide and thank you uh, note. So let's go ahead and install that on the back and see how it works. Now installing the glass back is a pretty straightforward exercise. You can see how thick this glass is and you notice that it has the nice cutouts here that are going to align uh, with your camera. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the back just like this. I already uh, wiped down this area here and as always make sure your air conditioner is off, your central heat is off or any fan is off. And then all you're going to do is just use this cutout right here to line the glass. What I'm also doing is you notice how I'm running my fingers here on the side. Um, in addition to having the glass alignment with the cutout, I'm just making sure that it looks straight. I just like to see it straight. So I'm just going to go ahead and, and look at it one more time and then I'll drop the glass. Now, because the glass cutout here is so precise, one of the neat things uh, that happens is as soon as you align it here, this kind of serves as a self-aligning tool. And you'll notice how the bottoms here are pretty precisely aligned and also the sides. Now, once you've rested it on the screen, it's going to start um, gluing itself because it's full adhesive. So then all you have to do is just rub it down. You could use your fingers to rub it down. Um, you'll want to make sure to make sure if you have anything on the bottom. It looks like I have something there. So I'm just going to lift it and use that removal sticky just to take it out. So I just went ahead and lifted the glass and then use the removal sticky to just go over the area where there were some still dust particles. And now you can see how nice and clean that install is. And again, because of how the glass aligns here, it just aligns real nicely. Uh, if we want to test if it still wirelessly charges, I'm sure it's going to. Notice a LED turned on and it's charging as well. All right, so the last product from Patchworks that we're looking at is their glass screen protector for the front of the phone. And it does include two removal stickers uh, that you can use for just making sure that your phone is clear. Now, a couple things I just wanted to mention about the protector. And this is something that I look at um, in all protectors as I review. So you'll notice here, first of all, uh, that it is case friendly. Notice how far away it is from the corners, which is important because the iPhone does have a curved screen. And if it's not uh, if it comes over too close to the corners, what's going to happen is it's going to have this halo effect. In other words, it's going to raise on the sides. The other thing is, as you look right here, um, it does not cover any of the camera or the sensors. So I also appreciate the fact that uh, they're allowing those things to stay uh, uncovered and that makes sure that there's not going to be any kind of optical interference. Now, that being said, this is a very clear uh, screen protector and it will not impact your touch, it will not impact clarity, um, and it won't impact your overall experience with using the iPhone or any case that you place on your iPhone. 
All right, guys, so that concludes our review of the patchwork cases, frame, glass screen protector, both front and back, for the iPhone X. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and thanks for watching. See you in the next one.